Air Reserve technicians, commonly referred to as ARTS, are a nucleus of full-time uniformed U.S. Air Force leaders, managers, operators, planners and trainers in what is known as the Air Reserve Component ARC of the United States Air Force, the ARC consisting of both the Air Force Reserve and the Air National Guard. Topic. Background ARTS have expert knowledge and proven expertise to maintain the operational combat readiness of Air Force Reserve Command and Air National Guard units and smooth the transition of Air Reserve Component units and both the full-time and traditional part-time military personnel from a peacetime environment to a contingency or wartime environment. They also provide leadership and management continuity, equipment maintenance, and training support to help keep the units combat ready. Air Reserve technicians carry a dual status, working as both full time Department of the Air Force Civil Service DAFC employees and as uniformed Reserve Component USAF military members in the same AFRC or ANG units where they work as civil servants, performing the same job function whether in a DAFC or a military status. ARTS are unique among DOD civil servants in that all commissioned officers and all enlisted personnel are required to wear their uniforms and utilize their rank titles at all times, whether in a DAFC civil service, regular drill, additional drill, or active duty status. The full-time use of military titles sometimes causes confusion, especially in interaction with active component personnel and particularly in the cases of those AFRC and ANG units located on active component air force bases, naval air stations, army air fields or joint bases. In the technically, civil service. Role Air Reserve technicians are physically located at their AFRC or ANG unit and provide full-time day-to-day support for their units throughout the year, be it at the squadron, group, wing, numbered air force or major command level. Because uniformed military reserve status is a precondition of their employment as DAFC civil servants, ARTS, specifically senior officers and senior enlisted, are typically exempt from the mandatory retirement dates for their military pay grades and are retained in uniform until reaching civil service retirement eligibility at age 60. It is this dual military and civil service status that differentiates ARTS from their full-time counterparts in the Naval Air Reserve and the Marine Air Reserve. Full-time support FTS personnel, formerly called Training and Administration of the Reserve TAR personnel, in the Navy and Active Reserve R personnel in the Marine Corps, while technically members of their respective reserve components, are actually full-time active duty career personnel assigned to reserve organizations of their respective services. In this sense, they are very similar to the Active Guard and Reserve AGR Air Force personnel also assigned to AFRC and ANG units. Note, the U.S. Army also has an Army Reserve Technician program similar to the USAF ARC program, as well as AGRs, in both the Army Reserve and the Army National Guard, with many assigned to Army aviation units. While it has a traditional, part-time, Coast Guard Reserve, the U.S. Coast Guard has no, full-time, reserve programs analogous to ART or AGR. Topic. Assignment and utilization Air Reserve technicians participate with both AGR personnel and other traditional reservists in AFRC units and traditional guardsmen in ANG units during weekend unit training assemblies additional weekday or weekend drills to include additional flying training periods, or AFTPs, for aeronautically rated officers and enlisted aircrew, annual training at active duty tours, and additional active duty tours for training, operational support or special work. Work ADT, ADOS, ADSW, the latter also referred to as man days for duty in both the continental United States CONUS and outside the continental United States OCONUS. ART personnel are also subject to mobilization, recall to full active duty with the regular Air Force pursuant to Title 10 USC 12301 and 12302 and subsequent assignment to regular Air Force or joint U.S. military organizations. In this instance, they may be mobilized 
as individuals and assigned to other units, or as part of the parent AFRC or ANG unit being mobilized to include federalized for ANG all or in part for duty in CONUS and or OCONUS, to include designated combat zones as part of Air and Space Expeditionary Forces AEF, ART personnel are predominantly assigned to operational AFRC and ANG flying units at the wing, group and squadron level, with a lesser number assigned to MAJCOMs, numbered Air Forces NAFs, non-flying units and staffs. The jobs span a broad spectrum within these organizations, including commander at the squadron, group and wing level, as well as various other Air Force specialty codes AFSCs. For commissioned officers, these AFSCs include, but are not limited to, pilots, navigators, combat systems officers, and air battle managers in nearly every USAF Mission Design Series MDS aircraft, flight instructors, tactics instructors and standardization, evaluators in those aircraft, space operations officers, combat rescue officers Kreush, aircraft maintenance officers MXOs, intelligence officers, security forces officers, logistics readiness officers LROs, nurses including flight nurses, meteorologists, and administrative, personnel and other force support officers. Enlisted arts are composed of enlisted aircrew positions such as flight engineer, loadmaster, pararescueman, and air refueling boom operator, as well as non-flying enlisted positions such as aircraft maintenance technician, avionics maintenance technician, air traffic controller, firefighter, security forces, airfield operations, communications, logistics, medical technician and administrative personnel. Arts comprise approximately 17% of total AFRC and ANG unit manpower, with aircraft and avionics maintenance employing roughly 60% of the enlisted ART workforce, where they average 17 years of job experience. Security forces personnel also comprise a significant number of the enlisted ART force. Basis. The ART program was first implemented in 1958 as the result of an Air Force study which showed that Air Force reservists and Air National Guardsmen could be trained, and their operational readiness maintained, by fewer full-time Air Reserve technicians than by a larger number of full-time active duty regular Air Force personnel. The Air Reserve Technician Program saved the Air Force $13 million in $1,958 USD during its first year of operation. As of 2012, Air Reserve Technicians comprise over 10,500 of all personnel assigned in the Air Force Reserve Command, or approximately 15% of total AFRC manning. ART manpower in the Air National Guard comprises a slightly higher percentage, numbering approximately 18,000 personnel or plus or minus 17% of total Air National Guard personnel strength in all 50 states, Puerto Rico, Guam, the Virgin Islands and the District of Columbia.